Hello Madonna fans, today I bring you another video and it's going to be the unboxing of the amazing album Something to Remember. This is an amazing album for me. I always think that every artist that we like must have this kind of balanced album. To, for example, if you like any pop artist or any rock artist or something like that, then any day you have this, you're in this mood that you want to uh, hear something really relaxing, like for to stay in home and drink wine and listening this kind of album so it's something to remember is the album that I always listen every time I'm in that kind of mood so today I bring you the unboxing of this amazing album and if you want to know if you want to see what this is about let's keep going with the video Okay, so as I said in the beginning of the video, this album is really special for me because I love this kind of days that you have, like your emotion or something like that. I love to be listening this kind of albums. And um, for me, that Madonna is a pop artist, a huge pop artist, and she used to do this kind of uh, move songs and all of that to dance and everything, uh, to have this kind of piece of her that you can feel the emotional and the soft part of her is really important for me because that that I can like um, get to her is like more personal to me so I have here two albums uh, two CDs this one is from a US release US pressing and this one is the German pressing as you can see the back is completely different the US from the Euro version I'm not sure if this pressing um, was taken to all Europe, but this is the German present. Um, it's really beautiful in the back. And um, right here is a vinyl, you know, I love vinyls, and I've been showing you uh, a lot of my uh, vinyls here in this channel. And um, okay, about this album, the best thing about this album, this is something about the background of it. Um, this album was released right after Bedtime Stories. Bedtime Stories was released in 1994 and this one was released in 1995 when uh, Madonna was in a really personal season of her life, uh, emotional uh, part of her life. She wanted to be a mother, she was planning all that and she felt like more mature. She was, I think that was the most mature point of her, of the Madonna career. Um, she was looking for something like this, uh, something really uh, warm and personal to release to the fans, not only to, uh, because every time she, rele she released a record, it's something really personal was happening in her life at the time. And this album is about that. And uh, in this album, we have three singles, three new songs, and the other songs are all songs, most of them not uh, released on a Madonna album before. Um, the three singles here, new songs, are I Want You, that was the first time this song uh, was released, One More Chance, and You See. You See is a beautiful ballad, amazing ballad, and this was the first time they released this song. Actually, the video, the musical video is a continuation. I see it like a continuation of um, of like the bedtime stories, the cabal uh, music videos. Those are really similar, uh, but I love them. I love the that kind of image that Madonna uh, looked here in those videos. And um, we have here, uh, this used to be my playground, was the first time this song amazing song one of the most amazing madonna songs and vulnerable and uh, beautiful powerful songs this used to be my playground this was the first time this song was released on the madonna album before so this was the first very first time she released this song in an, on an album and uh love don't uh love don't live here anymore we have something to remember from dick tracy Forbidden Love and Rain, one of my favorite ballads ever from the uh, Erotica album. Oh Father and I Want You. Um, 
but I remember, and this used to be my playground, those we knew about these songs when this album was released, but those songs, the first time those songs were uh, in a Madonna album was this time. Uh, so that's why she decided to add it in this album to have it on her amazing discography. Um, basically, this album, this is the US version. As you can see, it's white. And here you have this amazing, beautiful Madonna image in the back. She's lying on a bed here. And in the front, she's against the wall. It's, I love this artwork. Amazing. This is the EU US present. And here. So let's open it. And this is the inside of the album. As you can see, it's beautiful. It's a flower, a lotus. And you have here the CD. I'm gonna show it to you now. I don't know if the light is gonna let me show it to you really good. But it's a really nice artwork, as you can see here. This is the CD, and let's see the booklet of the CD. The booklet is, is really simple. Remember, this is a compilation album. Most of the times, the compilation albums uh, have not the same quality as um, the... Uh, releases the regular releases of the album and here we have the edition from Germany as you can see let's take off the plastic here I like to keep the series the In the best condition that, that I can, because for me the the condition of the of the merchandise is everything, and uh, uh, I'm a all time Madonna collector, so I try to keep stuff in the best condition I can. Um, here is the edition from Germany. You see, the back is different completely, but the songs are the same. And even the order of the song is 14 songs. It's the same too, but it's like in a different way. Here, I'm gonna show you right now what it says in Germany. Let me find it here. Uh, made in Germany. Here, I don't know if you can see it here. Made in Germany. Here, right here made in Germany and in the back is a lotus and let's open it and you can see the inside of the album is different to the CD completely different this one is white and the other one the one from US is yellow and the one from Europe from Germany is white so as you can see the difference between both is completely different and that's the amazing thing of having two different presents and here in the booklet let me show you the city more closer Something to remember, you have the track list there and the, uh, the symbol from Maverick Records, which is the company that Madonna founded. Let's see the bootleg. The bootleg is basically the same for both CDs the Lotus, and here is the um, all the songs with the uh, credits for the writers of every song so as you can see the only different mark, uh, remarkable vis visible uh, difference between these both albums are the back of the album and the um, the CD the color of the CD so you 
saw it already and that was it for this video i want to show you this and this is the vinyl i think i did an unboxing in another video already this is an amazing vinyl i love vinyls and okay so that was it for this video i hope you enjoy it and see you in another video of matama see you in the next one bye bye